Hey, Carlova Design here. I'm going to show you how to make a dice pouch. You can download the free pattern at my website and link is in the description. This is a small, easy project for beginners and I'm going to guide you through the process. You need a little bit of soft leather around 3-4 ounces thick. Mine is 5 ounces but still works just fine. This is a finished vegetable tanned leather but you can use any scraps you have on hand. Print the pattern and cut it out. It also has a square 1 inch by 1 inch, so you can check if the scale is correct. Stick the pattern pieces to the leather with the masking tape and cut out the pieces. I made this pattern for 4 mm stitching irons. I think that 5 mm would be a little too much for such a small project. Punch the holes for the drawstring. Let's finish the visible edges, although it's not easy to do on such a soft leather, but I will try my best here. Also, what I like to do is polishing the surface using tokenol. I like the patina and gloss that I can achieve by doing this on almost any leather.
Let's stitch the bottom to the main body. I prefer to do it in a way that uh, the body overlaps the bottom, but this pouch can be also stitched in a turned way. Now, if you have enough thread left, you can continue and stitch the vertical seam as well. If not, just finish the previous seam and start with a new thread. Make the drawstring stopper, join the ends in the middle and stitch through all three layers this way. Measure the right amount of lace and pull it through the holes on the pouch and then through the stopper. If your lace is soft, you may need some auxiliary, auxiliary tools, <laughs> like this little hook I am using.
tie the knots on the end of the drawstring. These are normal knots, but the ends are passed through the loops twice to give it more volume. Listo! Now you can use your new pouch to keep your treasures. If you want to learn making such patterns yourself, I have an excellent course for you on my website, and the link is in the description. I wouldn't mind if you like this video, subscribe to my channel or leave your comments. Thanks for watching.